Allison supposed to be here by now? She's not that late. She'll be here. She better be. I told my brother it was going to be the four of us. If he finds out that it's just you, me, and Casey, I'm going to be in trouble. Allison's not going to leave you in a lurch. She knows that if Raphael found out you were on a date alone without a chaperone, that you and Casey would be dead in the water. Hi, sorry. Hey, there she is. Oh, oh, oh. It, it's just a little spill. It happens all the time. See? It's like it never even happened. So, where's Casey? Pattering his nose. Oh. You look great, Allie. <laughs> Thank you. I love that color on you. Yeah, it's really nice. <laughs> hey, how's it going? Good. You? Good. Uh, Allison, congratulations. You finally made it. <laughs> Let's have a toast. To our first date? To Allison for making it possible. <laughs> to Allison. <laughs> So, what did I miss? Nothing much with a spot door. You guys want to order some food? Maybe later, thanks. When? Oh, no <laughs> way! <laughs> Allison Stewart, you look so different. So do you. I love the hair. The last time I saw you... Oh, uh, yeah, don't even uh, talk about it. That was another lifetime I've evolved. Uh, her mom works at Memorial, too. I haven't seen you in centuries. When did you start working here? Uh, just a couple weeks ago. I'm just doing it to make some extra bucks in between singing gigs. You're a singer? I do it all. I've got a band now. All chicks, the uh, itty bitty kitty crew. <laughs> what a great name. I love it. Oh, uh, Gwen, this is uh, Celia and Will and uh, this is Casey. We've met. Yeah, uh, we already said hello. I think I've seen you around school. In the cafeteria, maybe? <laughs> I try not to eat there if I can help it, but uh, sometimes you gotta do what you gotta do. Uh, that's me. Order's up. I'll be back. <sighs> She's so cool. Maybe we can go see her band play some night. You don't even know if they're any good. Why wouldn't they be? I'm just saying I can think of a lot of other things I'd like to do. Back me up here, buddy. Do you want to see some girl band? Uh, yeah, sure, uh, whatever. Allison, I was thinking. Oh, hold that thought. I'll be back in a flash. Hey, uh, we were just about to order, so what'll it be? My treat. Oh, that is too sweet. But since I'm the one who's responsible for the date tonight, it's only fair that I put the bell. So I've already told Gwen to put everything on my tab. You didn't have to do that. Yeah, I wanted to. So you can always pick out, order whatever you like. Thanks, Sally. Hope you're sure about this, though. Have you seen what Will here can put away? Me? This guy, he can eat a whole foot-long sub and then a pizza to boot. What can I say? I'm a grown boy. <laughs> but don't worry, Allie. I'll try to keep the gorging to a minimum. So uh, what do you want to do? Uh, we could go see a movie or go bowling, go to the mall, whatever. Um, actually, Aaron's a little understaffed tonight. I really ought to go lend a hand. You're not staying? I wish I could, but Betcher's really, really busy. What's my brother going to say when he finds out you're not hanging out with us? Oh, don't worry about it. I've got it covered. I found the perfect person to take my place. You did what? What is this? Don't freak out or anything. She's totally cool, super cute, and she knows about your past. She's totally cool with it. Allison, I don't like it when you do this stuff. And tonight, the role of Allison Stewart will be played by the gorgeous Gwen. Thanks. <laughs> I'm so psyched to be off my feet. Okay. You guys be good. Have fun. See you later. Bye. So, what looks good today, Gwen? I'm getting the heck out of here. So, uh, what are you guys up for? I don't know. Have any ideas? Definitely. Um, you want to go hear some music? Is there dancing? I, I don't dance. <laughs> you will after I get through with you. What about your band? Do you have any gigs tonight? But I know this club that I can get us all into for free. Really? What's it like? Uh, live music, dancing, and sometimes they have open mic night. <sighs> That's where I want to go. Can we, Casey? Maybe some other night. Uh, I promised Raphael I'd have you back to magic before it's too late. <laughs> what kind of date is that? The only kind my brother will let me have. I can't actually call it dating until I'm like 30. No way. What are you, like a nun in training or something? Feels like it. So, Allison said your mom works at the hospital? Yeah, seriously long shifts. Uh, X-ray tech, so I'm on my own a lot. <sighs> Lucky you. No interrogations when you come home after school. No one to lay down the law about your wardrobe or screen your phone calls. <laughs> no way. You come up with good enough excuses, the questions eventually stop. Maybe Gwen can help us come up with a reason you have to stay out later, so we can go to the club. Forget about it. I mean, 
If I have you late, you're not gonna be able to date until you're like 40. And you're not gonna be able to date me because I'm gonna be dead. Plus, it's not gonna be fair to Allison. So what are we gonna do, guys? Because if I'm in this diner for five more minutes, I'll go stir crazy. You wanna go out? Let's go out. What about us? I don't know. Have an adventure. Take a cab. Of all the cool clubs we could go to here or in Bay City, you choose Metro. Well, who said I wanted to go to Metro? Then what are we doing in their parking lot? Oh. I get it. You want to be alone. That's cool. I like you. You do? Why? You're quiet, mysterious. And it makes me wonder what it would be like to do this. Don't, OK? Right, so refresh my memory. What are we doing here? I don't know. Well, I know a way we can kill some time until you decide. No, I'm serious, all right? Just back off. Your friend Allison said you were totally hot, but you're a freak. You know that? Well, there's the door. You're a nut job, just like everybody says. All right, thank you. You know, you don't have to be so rude. Just get out, all right? Leave me alone. What is your problem, loser? It's Gwen. Hey, how's the double date going? It's not. What's wrong? That guy you said was so hot? Well? Why didn't you tell me he was a total weirdo with major, major issues? What are you talking about? What happened? I thought he wanted to go parking. Which was cool with me, right? But when I tried to get friendly, he totally freaked out, like ballistic. He threw me out of his car, Allison. Where is Will now? <laughs> That's the best part. Instead of driving out to Soldier's Hill, he decides we should park in the lot behind Metro. Tell Aaron I had to take care of something, but I'll see him as soon as I come back.